Folks at home, folks at home, out here with professional bass fisherman Mike Iaconelli. Ike, what are we doing today? We are doing the bacon bass fishing challenge. It's going to be an awesome day. We're going to try to figure them out on bacon. Sounds delicious, man. Let's do it. Let's do it. You've seen the buzz bait. You've seen the chatter bait. You've seen the spinner bait. But now, what we have here is the bacon bait. It's a straight up fish catcher. Let's go. We're trying the next bait. Ike, what do we got here? We've got, you know, when things are tough, we got a front coming through, clear water, go to a drop shot. Bacon on a drop shot. Key. Bacon shot. Bacon shot. <laughs> Let's get that hog, man. Here we go. Key You saw it right there, folks. Key baking tips by Mike Iaconelli. <laughs> Dude, something has to hit this. It looks way too good. Oh, no, it's just going to happen. <laughs> this, this is it. This is, this is the one, the baking shot, man. Oh. Oh! Do I? Want to hit it? Yeah, hold on. Ooh. Oh, I got him. Got him! Fish on! Oh, it's a sunfish show! <laughs> it's a sunfish! <laughs> on the bacon! First fish! On the bacon shot! <laughs> Not wow. the species we're looking for. That's alright, that's a good fish. That's a good looking sunfish show. We'll take it, we'll take it. Damn. Gotta say, Ike said it himself, this has some great action on it. Almost better than a robo worm. <laughs> Let's gotta go. Alright, next... <laughs> the next one's gonna be the 8 pounder, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> Oh! Oh! Oh, it's a good one! Oh! I got the pass! Oh! Get him! Oh! Let's go! First blood by Mike Iaconelli! Oh, the bacon bass, baby! Let me tell you, I get excited. Look at that, it's real. I'm shaking. I fished a long time. I'm 43 years old. I've been fishing for about 42 of those 43 years. This is my first bass ever on bacon. The bacon bass, baby! <laughs> Make sure everybody sees it up there. Everybody up here in the homeowners association is watching. It's a bacon bass. It's oh bacon my gosh. Bass. <laughs> number one, number one on a bacon strip on a drop shot. Look at that monster. Folks, this is why this man's a professional bass fisherman right there. He catches fish on bacon. And the bonus? <laughs> now he smells like bacon. <laughs> wow. Pretty awesome. Go back to your home. <laughs> nice, man. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> what wow. a beast. That is awesome. Pretty sick, man. <laughs> it does have crazy action. It does. <laughs> All kidding aside, it actually looks pretty good. <laughs> Even on the fall. <laughs> I'm not kidding. It looks really good. Switching up the baits. You guys have heard of the Jig and Pig. This is the literal version. Ike. Stop eating all the bait, man. I got hungry, man. Too much work. <laughs> Gotta try it before you judge it, right? Oh my god. What the hell is <laughs> You know, when I'm in uh, Texas, this is the bacon I throw. This is extra large. Uh, this is 18 inch bacon. It's only catches big ones. Thick cut. Thick cut. Everything's bigger in Texas, right, man? That's right. Everything. <laughs> we'll see how that works out. That has a lot of fat in it. This is a fattier cut, isn't it's it? A fattier cut. I, I changed. I, this is regular bacon. I left turkey bacon. I'm thinking I need to change here. This is like going from power bait to gulp. It's a slight change. <laughs> Let's try it. Because the fat keeps it on a thousand times better. Oh, it does? Oh, really? It's like kind of stick gummy or? Uh oh. Oh. Oh, this is oh. oh. It's over. It's over. Look. Holy. Guys, oh, let me get close to that. Show the action. Look at that. That, that looks like a real worm, man. It's over. It's <laughs> over. Not right now. It's, <laughs> it's over. <laughs> I could catch a monster. It's over. It's over, folks. Oh, yeah. This is... Dude, this ain't coming off. That ain't oh, coming off. Deal. Oh, this is over. I figured out... The, guys, figure folks at home, folks at home, I figured out the pattern. Gotta go with the bacon fat. Bacon fat. That stays on the hook like a charm. We're about to slay some big ones now. Let's do it. Oh! 
Oh, got him! Oh, on the chicken pig! Got him on the chicken pig, man! Oh, first bass of the day for me. The chicken pig, look at that bacon. Look at that bacon. It's a bacon fat. I called it. He called it, guys. The bacon fat. Nom, 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 nom. All right, we got a little guy. We're gonna upgrade. He's a little hungry going for this big chicken pig comma, but we got him, boys. I'm on the board now. All right. Guys, I don't know if you can see this, but look at this bacon action. Look at that. Look at that natural, subtle motion on this. So if there's shad in here, these bass would be all over this. I might have to market my own bacon line of baits. It'll be the, un you'll probably call them the USF, Unidentified Swimming Objects. Look at that thing. That's beautiful. Oh. Uh oh. He's on it. He's on it. He's on it. He's got it. He's got that. He's got it. <laughs> Oh! Oh, he got him! I got him, Bluegill! Got him! There you go. There. Fatty bacon. Nice pumpkin seed. Look at that. There it goes. The Dude, that's goes a chunk. <laughs> <laughs> nice job. Dude, that bacon. That's some good looking bacon. You got a purple in that fish. That's crazy. All right. Now, next up, what are you going to catch next, Ike? I don't know. I got, I'm two species down. I'm thinking a catfish. <laughs> catfish? Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> Hammerhead shark. <laughs> a bull shark, maybe? Bull maybe stock stocks the bull sharks in here. Ike, put it on the jig and pig. Put it on the jig. This is a little uh, missile bait jig called a mini flip and uh, designed this specifically for fishing with bacon trailer. As All right. See? And oh. we like that color, the uh, brown and purple. Looks like everything. Crawfish, bluegill, and shad wrapped up in one. Yep, the bacon imitates a shad. Got all the bases covered. Go get him, man. Yeah, the way they responded to this, it's not even... I lost all confidence. <laughs> lost confidence in the bacon. Try a little spoon. Oh, yeah, bacon tipped. Yeah. Oh, oh, there's one! Oh, on the bacon! <laughs> I got him! He's stuck in the bush! <laughs> on the chicken pig! Wow! That'll get our confidence back. Yeah. There we go, alright. We got 30 minutes left to fish. Not bad. We're gonna try to make it happen, guys. We haven't caught any monsters yet, but hey, still catching a couple. Two away from a limit. They're two away from a limit. Yep. If this, if there was a uh, four-inch size limit, then we could uh, do that. The smallest one of the day. Let him go in this pond. There might be more food in here for you guys. I just made a change here, and it's looking good. Grandparents live on this beautiful lake. They have a nice cabin in the woods. It's like there's like a vacation. Oh God! Look at the size of that catfish right there. What? Oh! <laughs> Throw the bacon at it. Throw the bacon at it. Oh, you see a giant catfish? Oh, guys, last two minutes, where'd it go? Last two minutes here. Never give up. Dude, I told you there's some giants in here. Giant, giant. Oh, man. We only have two minutes left to fish. All right, we're finishing up the bacon bass fishing challenge. Ike, tell us a little bit about today. Tough day. You know, uh, we had a front come through, tough fishing conditions, clear water. We had what we thought was the seeker bait, bacon, but it still ended up being tough. Caught a couple fish, caught three bass, a couple bluegill, good day in my book. Hey, I'll be honest with you, Ike, I think they would have bitten the uh, sausage length better. Might have been a sausage type of day. Next time we're gonna go sausage, or maybe we should have tried Canadian bacon. Oh, dude, true that. Hey, you know what the good news is about not catching too many? What's that? We got enough bacon to make BLTs for next month. Yeah! <laughs> Let's eat! <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for coming out, man, I really appreciate it. Good time, man. Bacon. <laughs>